Let's take a problem on mechanical properties of matter. A uniformly tapering conical wire is made from a material of Young's modulus Y and has a normal and extended length L. The radii at the upper and lower ends of this conical wire have values R and 3R respectively. The upper end of the wire is fixed to a rigid support and a mass M is suspended from its lower end. Find out the equilibrium extended length of this wire. So we draw whatever is given in the question. We have a conical wire of upper radius r and lower radius 3r. Its unextended length is given to be l. Now it's connected to a rigid support and a mass of capital M is suspended from its lower end. Under these conditions, let's say at equilibrium it suffers an elongation of delta L such that its new length becomes L dash which is the sum of L and delta L. Now to solve this question, we take an element from the wire at a distance x having thickness dx and radius of the cross section br. To find x and r, we suppose that if the support was not there and the wire be extended to a point such that the length after the support is q, then from the concept of similar triangles, we, we can say that q upon capital R is equals to Q plus L minus X upon small r is equals to Q plus L upon capital 3R. So from this two equation, that is this and this equation, we get Q is equals to L by 2 and from this and this we get R is equals to 3 capital R minus 2 X capital R upon L. Now we know that the Young's modulus Y is equals to F L A upon A into delta L where L is the initial length Delta L is the change in length. A is the cross-sectional area. And F is the force. Now to find the force, we have assumed that this wire is massless. So the tension across this wire is uniform and constant and equal to the weight that is balanced by it, that is tension T is equals to the weight mg balanced by it. So we can write here in this equation of the Young's modulus y is equals to f which is mg and for this element that is the element of radius r and thickness dx the initial length comes to be dx let's say it suffers an elongation of dy so delta y then becomes dy and area is pi into small r square. So we get y is equals to mg into dx upon, we substitute the value of small r which is 3r minus 2x r upon l whole square into pi into dy. Now taking dy on the left hand side and y on the right hand side we get dy is equals to mg upon pi y into dx upon 3r minus 2xr upon l whole square. Now integrating both sides of this equation dy from 0 to y and the right hand side equation from 0 to l we get y then y is equals to mg l upon 3 pi y 
r square that is delta l is equals to y is equals to mgl upon 3 pi y into r square so the new extended length at equilibrium is equals to l plus delta l which is equal to l into 1 plus mg upon 3 pi y r square